Hello, Nagi soldiers. I hope you people are doing well. So finally, the wait is over. Gate 2022 online application started from today onwards. My friends, in this video, I'm going to cover all the important points which you should keep in mind while filling the application form. I don't want any one of you to commit mistake while filling the form. So stay tuned till the end. So let us start. Just type gate 2022 in Google. A website will come on the top www.iitkgp.ac.in. You just click on that website. On the right hand side, you'll be seeing gate 2022 online application. Just below that, you'll be seeing uh, apply online tab. You just click on that apply online tab. The moment you are clicking, what is going to happen? A notification will come important instructions. Don't worry, let me explain you. According to first instruction, you should have updated valid photo ID. That's it. Updated one. What is the, why they are asking updated one? So that your photograph should match with the photograph which you are having on photo ID. That's it. Now listen carefully. What are the valid photo IDs this year? Aadhaar card, your driving license, PAN card, passport. Remember, this time your college ID is not valid photo ID. Okay. Second point, you should have colorful PDF. Okay. To upload. Chalo. Let us start. Okay. The moment you are closing this pop-up, you will be coming to the register page where you need to fill your name, mobile number and mail ID. And you have to put one password also. So while you are putting the name, let me come to the name. You have to fill first name, middle name and surname. Now generally what happens in southern part of the country, your surname will be coming first and then other things. So my friends, you have to make sure whatever the name you are having in your intermediate certificate or maybe your BTEC mark sheets and all same thing you have to fill if your surname is coming first then make sure you are putting your surname in place of first name okay clear now another point when you are filling the password your password must have 8 to 15 characters Hana? less than 8 it will not accept more than 15 it will not accept okay now the moment you are submitting all these details your name mobile number mail id and your password a message is going to come on your mobile and mail ID, whatever you have filled regarding your enrollment ID for gate 2022. Okay. Now let us move forward. Now you will be, you will be logging in, right? You will be logging in and you will be filling your exam details. Now in your exam details, they will be asking you number of papers with which you want to write your gate 2022 one or two by default it will be on one that radio button will be on one if you want to write your gate 2022 with two papers select the two select the two take your radio button to the two you click on that two radio button basically okay now now listen carefully here i want to add one more point those who are going to write their second paper secondary paper as xc engineering sciences you need not to fill there will be no option of filling the two subjects in application form those two subjects you have to select in examination hall in the month of feb i hope you are clear now here you need to fill the examination city also okay there will be three options uh, there will be three cities which you need to put okay uh, there will be so many options means all the options will be available for city one so you have to select now when you are going to city two and city three what is going to happen your option will be getting reduced according to your city one so don't worry about that part sir where remaining cities are there they they are automatically selected they are automatically reduced as per your city one okay now you will be coming to the next tab where you need to fill the personal details now here i want to tell you one important thing there will be a there will be a tab of verify email address verify mobile otp so of course you will try to verify your mobile number immediately otp will come you need not to worry for mobile number the moment you are clicking on tab you will be getting the otp on your mobile if you are not getting you just put recent you just click on recent otp it will come as far as verify email address 
OTP is concerned, that OTP is taking some time. So don't worry, go ahead. I already filled one of the application form of my student. That's why I'm saying it is taking some time. If it is taking some time, don't worry, just move ahead. Okay. Now, one more thing, my friends. In the same personal detail, you have to select the category. Don't worry if you are not having the certificate right now. You need not to upload any category certificate as of now. But in future, you should have whenever required. Okay. Now, here itself, you have to fill the details of valid photo ID. Whatever the valid photo ID, PDF, colorful PDF you are going to upload in upload section, same details you have to give here. I already told you, Aadhaar card, driving license, PAN card, passport. Okay. Theek hai? Fine. Now, let us come to the next tab. Address for correspondence. Means, if, if they want to send you some, some documents where they should send, right? So my, uh, there will be so many hostlers. So I will be advising you don't give your hostel address and all better. You give your hometown home address, right? The next step will be qualifying degree details. Now here, please try to understand. You have to put institute registration oblique roll number. So here you need to give your college roll number or college enrollment number or university enrollment number, which is permanent, which is fixed, right? Now listen carefully. There will be one more thing which you need to put. Have you graduated in about degree? Now here you have to be careful. If you are already passed out, put yes. And if you are in third year or fourth year currently in the college, then put no. Remember, you need not to take any certificate from HOD or principal. Okay. Now the next step will be upload documents. Here you need to upload your photograph, signature and your photo ID. Now my friends, when you are going to upload your photograph, make sure it is colorful, color photograph with white background. Okay. JPZ, JPZ format is allowed. Pixels you have to set minimum is 240 into 320 the size range is 5 kb to 200 kb in signatures your pixel minimum pixel is 80 into 280 and size allowed is 3 kb to 200 kb okay as far as your photo id is concerned you have to upload the pdf pdf of photo id size range is 10 kb to 600 kb now of course if you are filling the form first time you'll be facing two much difficulties adjusting the size and all those things pixels and all those things so you can use various softwares you can use paint or q q reduce light this is the software with which you can uh, you can manage the size and pixels right and let us come to the last point fee details but you can pay your fee with the help of debit card credit card internet banking even upi wallet everything is allowed okay now one more thing my friends those who are going to fill the application form with two papers your application fee will be getting doubled for example you are from the general category then 1500 for uh, one paper it will be 3000 for two papers okay and if you are having any doubt please type your doubt in comment box i will be replying or you can whatsapp me directly please note down my whatsapp number for any query any query regarding to your gate 2022 application form or regarding xc paper and all 829224719 thank you so much love you all take care